This exercise is called Project Mountain. Its intent is to help you tackle small to medium sized projects that you can't seem to get traction on. It could be something from your five whys page or a project you're currently working on. Pick a project or goal that needs to start soon or that you've been putting off. Write the name of the project at the top of a new page and below it, the list of tasks or activities that need to be done to complete it. It's lists like these that can sometimes be a block or obstacle to making progress. At the top of a new page, draw the top portion of a triangle. Put the title of your project off to one side or inside of it. This triangle is the mountain. At the bottom, draw a circle or some other shape as the starting point. Now write out the various steps from the checklist, but spread them out between the starting point and the mountain. and give each one a container. If it's a task with defined steps, draw a rectangle around it. If it requires some research, draw an oval around it. If the task is conceptual, creative, or requires your choice in how to do it, draw a cloud around it. From the starting point, draw a line to the very first task or tasks that need to be started first. If any task requires another task to be completed, then it can't connect to the starting point. Draw a line from those tasks to the next. If more than one thing needs to happen to unlock that task, draw lines from both of them to this task. Do this until all the tasks have been connected and draw arrows from the last tasks to the mountain triangle. Now ask yourself, which set of tasks are the most important to the project? Thicken the lines on that path from the starting point to the mountain. This is your critical path. The other paths are important, but they're secondary. Instead of a linear path, we have choices of what we want to or feel inspired to work on. If we get stuck down any one of these paths because of distraction, demotivation, fear, etc., we can spend some time on another path and still make progress. Having all of the paths laid out ahead of you and having a choice of where to start will hopefully allow you to make progress on any project even if you've been putting it off.